Hey, this is Jenny Jones, Digital Grove Hacks Club. All right, so listen, if this is your first time to this channel, please go ahead and like, subscribe. I'm always doing these hacks, doing these hack packs. I'm going to give you guys an AI hack pack, one of my best ones for Persona. So I'm going to call this my Persona hack pack, right? All right, so let's get into it. And again, if this is your first time to this channel, please go ahead and like, subscribe. I do have, uh, I'm extending my community membership uh, starting next month, um, August 1st. I'll be launching my my uh, brand new community and pulling, um, pulling the covers off out over from over that. Uh, you'll be able to connect with me if you need to get on my calendar, you wanna pick my brain, go deeper, want me to do some case studies with you. Listen, that I'm opening up all of that. You'll be, you'll be able to get in contact with me. We, <clears throat> with me for that so that's coming right so listen i'm not going to hold you long i'm going to show you something that's going to probably blow your mind when it comes to personas now what i what i have in front of you is uh chat gpt but this is the ai prm um plugin that goes with Jet chat gpt a lot of people don't know about this but it is out there um there's a cost associated with this right uh, it's put together by a group of engineers and a consortium that they have and they charge people to get to it. I think maybe the lowest price is maybe uh, $15, anywhere between 15 to 24 to, to 34, up to a couple of hundred bucks a month to get access to this. Now, what you see in front of you, these are prompts. The power in chat GPT or AI in general is prompts, right? So what we had last year, the last two years, even prior to uh, chat GPT is you had all these writing tools, right? Uh, I think I have them all probably, right? Uh, that scale nut, I have scale nut, uh, I have closers copy, right? I have niches, right? I have writer, I have long shot, right? I have uh, write sonic, right? I have uh new on writer, which is very good by the way. Mm -hmm. Um, I also have copy Smith, right i also have big biq right i have i even have the intelligent one which is crawl q.ai powerful right so i have all these writing tools right but what if i wanted to find out a buyer persona in like three minutes right and so what i would do here is if even if i use this particular one what you have to do is you still have to put in, like if I wanted to do buyer persona legend, right? I still, this is the prompt, you still have to put in, hey, what is your business sell? What are your clients? They're still asking me, right? And I still have to get all these inputs just to get the information out. I don't know if I can use it because I haven't paid for it, uh, but I just wanted to show you what the plugin looks like. And they do have plugins out there for ChatGPT, right? What I wanted to show you was a tool uh, now, let me give you my disclaimer. Once you see this tool, once you see it in action, you will know if it works for your business or not, right? I have all these writing tools because I write a lot, right? Um, I, I run a lot of blogs and I do a lot of different writing, trying to do some search engine optimization. So I write a lot, right? So I had a lot of writing tools when they were coming out. I like the different twists that some of the AI tools have. Buyer beware. There's a new AI tool that drops at least once a week, right? You have, and all of them are putting their different spin on it. So I would wait for different ones that I like. I purchased the ones that I like that use that, that looks good in my business that I can use. So I don't know if you'll need this one. I promise you about 90% of you will be attracted to this one because we struggle with buyer personas, right? Who is my client? Who is my customer? Can I identify them? Can you pick your client out in a lineup of 100 people down at the police station? One of those people are your clients. Can you pick them out? Do they wear sweaters? Do they wear shirts? Do they wear jeans? Do they wear shorts? Do they wear hats? Do they wear sunglasses? What kind of what kind of suntan lotion do they use? That is a persona, right? And there's two different ways. There's a demographics and then there's a psychographics so when it comes to personas. That's way beyond the scope of this. I think I have a course on that somewhere. I don't know, but I've talked about this ad nauseum, right? And so what I need you to do is understand what I'm about to show you. You can write, you can put a, you can put a buyer persona together in 
five minutes, maybe three minutes. All right, so we'll test it out. But I want to show you, kind of give you an overview of what this tool does, right? So the name of this tool is called Super Copy, right? And when we had all those writing tools that came out, they were just using prompts and just using AI to kind of help you beware on AI because it only goes back a couple of years, right? It doesn't go way back, right? But use AI. I say I'll call it artificial influence or artificial um, enhancers, right? And that's kind of what I'll call it. I know I don't like to swear with everything AI and then just put it out there. No, I like to use it for idea generation. I like to get an idea of what it can do and then add my little pieces to it and make it personal, right? So everything I do, I'll just sprinkle in maybe a lot of stuff I just write on my own and then let AI kind of put the sweetener on it as well. So the tool is called Super Copy. Now, I can promise you, you haven't seen this tool before, right? I just showed you ChatGPT right? And you have to put all these prompts in. The power in chat GPT or some of these, these AI tools is it's the prompts and it, and it gets that from you. What this tool is, what I love about this tool is the power of the prompts. They're already there. You just put in a couple of things. So I want to show you what I did and then we're going to do one together, right? So I, I have this new, you know, I have this new website I launched on easy course, right? plug for easy course. It's very easy to use uh, was I went there and I told them, I gave them the name of my website and I told them what I want to do, provide financial literacy for youth. That's all I told them. That's all I want to do. Right. And we'll come back to product later. And from that, I want them to generate some different audiences for me. And this is what it did. Right. And this is a brand, right? So these are, this is what it came back with. It came back with responsible mom, Right. And I told them my target, I, I want to provide financial literacy for that targets women or mothers, right, of small children, teens, youth, young adults. That, I put all of that in there. This is what it gave me back. It gave me um, seeking. This is for a responsible mom. These are the personas, a responsible mom, an optimistic mom, a familiar financier mom. Right. It gave me Max Financial Literacy Advocate, Miss Financial Savvy, Financial Literacy Steward, right? Ambitious Mother, Financial Literacy Seeking Parent, Working Mom. And it gave me ages, right? 40 to 30, 32 here, 22 here, 31 there, 37, 32. I have to figure out which persona that I like best, right? This one is an ambitious mother. She's age 40. This one is a financial literacy seeking parent. They're age 40. This one is busy, responsible, working mom, right? Uh, age 32, right? So it gave me these personas, but let me show you what else it did. So we'll click on this one and we'll just look at the edit here real quick. This is what it gave me. I can go back. If I change it here, it'll start giving me new different, it'll start giving me different language here. And then I can save the persona out and use it for later. And so what you can do is you can have these different brands, but let me show you what else it did. This is a powerful tool. Not going to spend that long with you. In, but look, I want to discover new personas that I've already, I've already, I put this in once. This is a prompt, right? I put this in my, I put my brands in once and I put my product in. This is kind of what I want to talk about my teen boot camp, right? And since, you know what, find me new personas, right? So I click on that. My, my brand is already in there, right? So next gen home economics, I already wrote it once. Hey, looking for moms, trying to teach financial savvy, right? Teach your kids, make them savvy, right? Um, and so I put that in there, right? Now I'm going to hit discover, right? It starts writing new ones instantly instantly you 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 have no idea how powerful this is right so then i could save them right financial literacy savvy mom i want to save these i want to save them to my library i can come back and rely upon them later but what if i wanted to do a couple things i can do from here i can write a blog right so let's talk about what i want to do uh, I can write a blog. I can write an email. I can write uh, a blog. I want to do a social media post on my new boot camp that's coming. Right. So I already have it here. 
I got a team boot camp. That's the product I want to talk about. I can talk about my team boot camp. I can talk about my my uh, my uh, debt credit card debt uh, boot camp. I can talk about my college first year on college uh, boot camp. But I, this particular one, I want to talk about my team boot camp. So let's go back to it. And I want to write a social media post, right? Uh, let's do Facebook, right? Let's go to Facebook. So it's our, everything's already there. I don't have to keep punching, typing everything in, right? Uh, right here. I would have to keep typing things in. It's not going to give me everything that I just gave you. I have to keep punching it in. It says, what do you want the tone to be? What do you want the writing style to be? What do you want the, uh, the English the, uh, the output to be, right? I only had to type it in once, right? You come here, you select your brand already. I already have my brand there. You can put in several brands. I think you can put in unlimited brands. I'm gonna have to go back and look at that. But my next gen home economics, that's what I got. My persona, I mean, my product persona is teen boot camp, right? Teen boot camp. That's what I got, right? I probably should have put teen financial boot camp. And then this is audiences is is, um, is Miss Financial Savvy. That's the one I could select from different ones here. Maybe a busy mom, uh, financial literacy savvy mom. I like that one better. So we'll put the financial literacy savvy mom there, right? And then what we're gonna do is we are going to generate a post. All right, so here's what we got, right? Attention all super moms, right? Looking to give your kids a head start in life, introducing our teen financial boot camp. I can't, you can't, you can't make this up. Look at all these posts that it gave me for Facebook, right? And it gave me the hashtags, teen financial bootcamp, money smart teens, secure their future, calling all super moms, right? Calling all moms of school age teens, uh, kids, teens, and young adults want to give your children a head start. It wrote this for me automatically. Next Gen Home Economics, it put all this stuff in here for me automatically. Listen, you cannot tell me, and it can do that, but let me show you one other thing that it can do as I kind of wrap up here. I write a lot of blogs as well. So again, going back to what I would call the first generation of AI and AI tools, I had to prompt, I had to write, and had to ask for assistance um, in some of the writing um, that I had to do. I had to ask for a lot of the writing here. This one, let me show you my prompts. Let me go back here. Let me see. I, I want to write a blog, right? So let me write a blog, construct a short blog for readers within seconds, right? So I'm going to use this template. Again, I'm going to go to, uh, please select a brand. I already brand is already there, right? Um, teen bootcamp. We got that audience i want this for um um i want this for miss financial savvy for this audience and i'm writing a blog so my goal is to write an article about um teen savings and investing to write an article about teen savings and investing i'll put at a young age i'll just add that and so that's what i want to write so i wanted to give me a draft really quick so i hit that right so write an article about teen savings and investing at a young age all right so let's see what we got here Boom, right? So highlight the sections you wanna regenerate if you wanna regenerate another section. So this is a blog already, it's done, right? So you would take this, write this, you would probably drop it in a tool like Nuon Writer, right? And you can enhance it and sweeten it up a little bit and put some keywords in it uh, to define it and get it just right perfect before you put it up and you blog. But listen, people, this is it. I, I just wanted to show you, this is a fascinating piece of software. I don't have this nowhere in my arsenal. I added this. I did, let me show you where it's at. It is on AppSumo 
$29. That's all you need to do is get started $29. If you like and you like the output, I would do more, right? Um, I got a tier two just in case if I have a client that wants me to do something for them, right? Um, I wouldn't do tier three unless I was running an agency of some sort. I would probably do that, but you can get away with it. You can actually get away with a tier one, but I think a tier two is nice. It's a nice um, one to use. They use GPT uh, 3.5 Turbo and, and Chat GPT 4 and all future models. You're gonna get that with this marketing brainstorms, blog content, social media content. I just showed you, and this is like I said, it's 20. You can buy this, you get a 60 day money back guarantee. If you don't like it, just return it. Uh, no questions asked. They'll either give you a credit or they'll just credit your credit card or your PayPal or, or what have you. Uh, AppSumo has been around for some time. Uh, I own lots of tools from AppSumo, and I think they do a pretty good job in trying to bring tools here at a lifetime deal discount or one time cost. So again, people, this is what we got. If I go back here, I want to just show you the dashboard and just show you some of the other things we can do. Even if I went social media, I can do a tweet. I can do a TikTok caption. I can do a LinkedIn. Let me, since you're still here and I just want to show you, let me, let's show what a, a, a tweet would look like. If I did a tweet, let's use the same uh, persona, right? Uh, the brand is next gen. I can create any brand there, right? And then my product is going to be teen bootcamp. Right. My audience is going to be responsible mom. Right. Oh, no, we'll go working mom since it's Twitter. Right. You see, I changed that up. Right. And so my goal is to uh, my goal um, invite working moms to sign their kids up to my teen financial boot camp starting in two weeks right so that's what we got so that's what i want to generate i just want to generate a tweet that's all i want to do generate a tweet boom just that fast calling all working moms right Want to give your teens a head start of financial success? Join our teen financial boot camp starting in two weeks. They're learning ABCs of money. You, you can't make this up. This is so fascinating, right? And so you just take that and then you just copy it and you can rewrite the ones that you don't want to write. Oh, folks, this is... So I like this, right? I, I, I'm I want to learn a little bit more about the founders. I'm really going to try to get them on the show. But again... Hey, I, and I'm definitely going to invite them to um, to join my community and join the Founders Roundtable. We're going to be able to pick their brain and see some things that they want to be able to come up with. Hey, listen, I'm going to have a lot of things coming out of my community here. You guys might want to join for that. You might want to look out for that. It's coming, right? Hey, this has been Jenny Jones. You guys have been great. Take care. Look for it. Hey, if you need it, if you need to pick this up, there should be a link in the description below. Alrighty, 60 day money back guarantee. Take care. Goodbye for now.